New at 5, 1 October changed everything. Now medics are stepping up their game, intense training. Better emergency response, all to keep you safe. 13 Action News anchor Lizzie Marine introduces us to this new team of tactical first responders. From an active shooter your mask. to tear gas. I can feel like burning around my neck and stuff. This team of eight paramedics from AMR Medic West Hoorah, are training to become the newest tactical team in the valley. <laughs> but being a part of this team, far from a walk in the park, Leslie Schaefer has spent 13 years as a paramedic. No call could have prepared her for this. Mentally, we're kind of preparing for it, but once you're in there, it's something completely different. The paramedics put through SWAT exercises. First, a tear gas chamber. It gets to the point where it starts choking, can't breathe. Jalapeno peppers rubbed all over my body. My two medics that are off, I need a diamond, a diamond of four. But before they could fully recover, the team's responding to an active shooter scenario. Right now, they're trying to give aid to the people who were shot in this active shooter training situation. Now, this situation is all too real for some of these paramedics. We were all there on October 1st. The idea for this team was born out of tragedy. We had uh, a lot of lessons learned after 1 October. The biggest lesson, the only way to save more lives is to get paramedics on the front lines. The traditional model was for us to sit back. Wait, make sure it's completely safe. We're wasting precious minutes at that point. Putting their lives on the line to save yours. We want to give back to our community in a bigger way, something that we can do more, uh, Lord forbid, October 1 never happens again. Leslie Marine, 13 Action News.